Rue Ami <laughs> Ami what is <laughs> What do you say to Like you I, 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 Even though Granny lost her memories She never forgot to show me how much she loved me So I thought maybe one day I could become a cool adeptus like you And help a whole bunch of people Just like Granny wanted to do can one simply train enough to become an adeptus though? <laughs> like uh is that uh is that how that works? I don't remember. I bro I have no clue. Upon some reflection, one Maybe? supposes you are no mere mortal. The fact that you and I's blood flows through your veins is proof enough of that. If this is what you desire, one shall make it so Oh yeah, that's right. Does she ah uh, maybe. Maybe actually. Thank you so much, Madam Adeptus! No, uh, I mean, master. Well, now you have to three, three children. Good job. I <laughs> chew you. Are you sure about this? Paimon's gonna let you in on a little secret. We've seen Cloud Retainer's two other disciples, and they pretty much eat nothing but bitter herbs like chin chin <laughs> and violet grass. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're right, actually. <laughs> War is hurting gonna be <laughs> warm. If you join them, you'll never enjoy one minute restaurant's delicious cooking ever again. Uh, how utterly preposterous. One has never enforced such a rule. Every individual must find their own path to enlightenment. So long as one retains a pureness of spirit, one's dietary proclivities are quite irrelevant. Okay. Well, you say that, but Paimon's not seeing any tasty treats up here now, is she? Hmm. <laughs> Although Mount Outsong is rich in natural beauty, its location does preclude access to certain finer mortal comforts. That is precisely why one plans to relocate to Liyue Harbor. Shu Yu shall have the honor of becoming one's first disciple in the human world. Woo! Huge! Is that why you took uh, on this human form? One has never concerned oneself with the location of one's residence. From the very beginning, one has sought only solace and peace. Imagine Zhong Li walks by like, eh, oh, wait a minute, what is this? And then then this and then he see this baddie, he's like, wait a minute. Cloud retainer! I'm joking. Yet in the end, all what? of one's disciples ended oh up in Liyue what? Harbor. Gone you. One has reflected Sorry, on this I fact for oh many my years God. now. I'm leaving. One can only assume Bye. that it is Please, due to up. some failing on one's part as an elder or master. A failing, perhaps, of recognizing what it was they truly wanted. One is most curious as to what aspect of Liyue Harbor could have enticed them to remain there. <sighs> One could hardly offer an opinion on the matter, but perhaps some time in the harbor will prove instructive. Why are you all so silent? <laughs> uh. Oh, damn. Does this mean we can grab a meal together in Liyue Harbor sometime? Hmm. One has precious little time to squander. However, if one finds oneself otherwise unoccupied, one would not be opposed to the idea. Ooh. One will be assuming the identity of a human while residing in Liyue Harbor. You should take care to avoid disclosing one's true identity. Don't worry, you we'll help you keep it a secret. Well, it was not like we did anything. It was you who said I did. You were. <laughs> it wasn't even us. Was so, uh, when can we expect to start seeing you in the city? Perhaps in two days' time. One has some matters to see to before one's departure. Preparation is the key to success, after all. One plans to put up various items from one's collection for sale. The earnings should provide for a comfortable living in Liyue Harbor. One has already picked out a handsome property near Chuhu Rock. Tis no small purchase, but what is mortal life if not one expense after another? 
seems like you've really thought of everything. Then how about we meet up in Leeway Harbor in two days? Man, man, listen, listen, listen. Just, just, just open up in OnlyFans. Trust me. Hey, tr hey, hey, Cloud Tainer, trust, trust me. Hey, you will be richer than rich, man. You could take over Tayvat, brother. Unless, you know, other baddies like Yaylan or something make an OnlyFans. Then you will have competition, you know, but if not, hey, hey, trust me. She could. A sensible plan. See you then. Oh, also, why don't you take this suspense insomnia mechanism as a souvenir? Anytime you should feel ill at ease in the future, you may try quieting your mind and sitting in meditation as you listen to its melodies. It might help you find a new perspective. That, that would be pretty cool. Awesome! Thanks, Cloud Retainer! Oh, hey, that's it. didn't we promise shin oh. that we'd tell him what we found out? Should we make a trip to the Feiyun Commerce Guild? It's totally up to you. I mean... I had something I was gonna say. Oh frick, I forgot. Uh oh yeah. Technically, right? Like Cloud Trainer doesn't have to like if she opens all the fans, right? She doesn't have to post like what the girl posts there, like more of you know like she could just post picture of her normally. Like, you know, people forgot people will still buy it. Like if she don't post anything not on like uh, Instagram or other social media, right? Like her picture. Like she could just post a bunch of picture of herself or something. People would just buy that anyway. They'd be like, "Oh my gosh, she is gorgeous," you know. I mean, uh, uh, like imagine Shen had opened up one that's for old. Ah. By the way, Shuyu, we have a friend who helped us learn a lot of information about your granny. Is it okay if we tell him the full story? Sure, I don't think Granny would mind, as long as you don't tell a whole bunch of people. I feel, I feel, I feel so much safer now, and you know, I can't secure that she is, you know, with Cloud Retainer or whatnot. So, so they don't really live together, I guess. But like, you know, wait, how was she supposed to get money? Although, are they supposed? To, there's probably some some kind of help she gets. So, no, no worry about that. I don't think she'd want too many people to know. They might go to Mount Outsong and start bugging her about it. Bug. Granny needs to focus on her training, you know? But telling a friend or two is probably fine. No worries! Our friend can keep a secret! I mean, he's quiet in the mouth, so he, he's dead ass quiet. Oh, I mean you! Yeah, that's, 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 that's you! That's you! Yeah, I'm talking to you! Ass hat. Talking to you. Tell the other adepti about it? I have left an explanatory note in my abode. Those two old fossils will discover it, I am sure, should they come seeking my company. Well, I want to see how this Lanterite story is gonna be. We're gonna probably we're probably gonna see her move in and everything in her place, that would be really cool. Considering their recent pension for going off on private escapades, however, I find myself caring little for how they shall receive this news. I like that. It's so cute. It's so fitting. I don't know. It's so, so cute when she does that. Um, you know, uh, this story was actually pretty decent. Not that bad, actually. It's um. Wait, we gonna see the move now? Wait, it's two days. Uh, wait a minute. We gonna see the move? Hold on. Hold on. We actually gonna see the move. Huh. Uh -huh. Your concerns are excessive and unfounded. This is but a simple collection of ordinary valuables. Such intense scrutiny is hardly necessary. What's uh, happening? To be quite honest, your insistence on that fact is my primary cause for concern. In what way are any of these ordinary? Every single item here could be worth more than everything I own combined. <laughs> I simply can't risk shelling out that kind of mora without proper scrutiny. If I'm wrong, I would never be able to earn it back, not even if I worked every single day for the rest of my life. I have to be careful. Yes, you can never be too careful. We're here, Quo! Uh, Miss Shenyun, what are you guys arguing about? 
Karma, why are you so sucky at this? Ah, perfect timing. This ignoramus is questioning the authenticity of my wares. Oh. I'll have you know, these items have remained untouched in my personal collection for several hundred years. Hey, wait, wait. To question their legitimacy. <laughs> several hundred years? She. <sighs> She has a brain somewhere in there, right? It, indeed. <clears throat> oh well, I mean, it could They're be family heirlooms, you see, yeah. passed down over many generations, as families are wont to do. Yep, yep, they've definitely been around a while. We can vouch for her on that one. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> nah, they should, bro, bro. All people in Liyue should know who the F we is. Okay, we saved you guys. Two times, two times, two, two. Don't, don't, don't get it twisted. Two times, okay. Three, if you, if we count the the uh, our 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 I I I don't know his name, but I don't know his name. The frog drug dragon. Hear that? Had I not found myself in need of Mora, I would scarcely have had the heart to part with them. Indeed, you should consider it an honor to even have the opportunity to behold them with your own eyes. Hey. <laughs> Doubt their authenticity any further, and I may just decide to take them to another buyer. <gasps> whoa, 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 please don't go. I apologize for any insult, miss. You see, I know full well that I lack the knowledge to judge the true <laughs> worth of these items. If you could wait but a moment. I've hired an expert to appraise them for me. He should be here shortly. An expert, you say? Oh, very well. I will wait for a little while longer then. Traveler, Paimon, this is my new residence. If you have cause to seek my company in the future, this is where you can find me. Oh, that's nice. I feel like... I, I, I not feel like... Um, I would really love... To see Jong Lee come by here, I want no. I just want to see his reaction to to her taking human form. It's probably not going to be as like anyone else. Like everyone else, going to be. Like, I mean, his reaction is most likely going to be exactly the same as like probably Zhao or something. I don't know. Be like, oh, well, I see that you have um, returned to your uh, human form. How interesting. Was this uh, the occasion or something like that, you know? Master! Oh, it's you two again. Oh, she's close! Hello! Shiryu! You got a new outfit! It looks great on you! That's cute. I like that. Mm hmm. Master made it for me. I like Aww. it too. Aww. It's good. Huh? You know how to make clothes? <laughs> Do I know how to make clothes? With the support of the proper mechanism, sewing is hardly a challenge. Looks like Shiori has um a competitor. Master, I brought in most of my stuff. Rip gang. There's a few boxes left, but they're kind of heavy, so I just left them outside. <laughs> just two boxes. Fret not, I shall help you move them into your room. No, oh, they live together. No, they're so sweet. They actually do live together. No uh, way. Actually. I should probably uh, sort through my stuff a bit first. Everything's kind of messy right now, so maybe you could um not look yet, Master. Oh, yeah, it's so great. cute! Oh, I love that. I love that. Actually, no, oh, it's like that little child with her again, so you don't have to feel lonely. You know, because that's because that's usually how it feels like, right? Because um, I talk with my grandma a lot. I I come and visit her, talk to her because. Otherwise, she will be kind of alone, you know. Since her her children and whatnot, they um, have grown up, do their own thing, have children, have work. They don't have as much time to come and visit, you know. And that can feel really lonely for her, right? So that's I feel like that's how a cloud retainer is feeling right now. With Chunha is now as well going out to work and do her own thing outside of the, you know being in the, in the mountain and whatnot. And the same thing with Ganju. Ganju works basically all the time, and you know, not have as much time to be with her basically mom. But now, Cloud Retainer has another child that you know 
that will feel that little emptiness that 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 you know. Ah, I I love it. It's great acting. <laughs> it's great. I like it. It appears my young apprentice has her own fair share of secrets. No matter. Do what you must, child. They live now, together. This expert you mentioned. When can we expect her? Right, and um, wait, or am I dumb? That she move her box, and I felt like that's just like it means like they're moving. That's the. That's, I'm 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 understanding this right, right? This is their new place. They live together. To your room, she, yeah. Move to into your new. Did she say new room or something? So basically, it would be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it right. I got it right. Soon, soon. Ah, there he is. Huh? Oh my God. Wait. Here, allow me to oh! make some introductions. This is Mr. Zhang Li, a well-respected oh! consultant at Wang Shang Funeral Parlor and an expert in all manner of valuables and antiques. Oh, I oh, oh, I just oh, oh, I can't take it no more. Oh, I just oh my god, oh my god, I oh man, oh this is oh what I wanted as well. Oh man. Ah. Man, I love you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Mr. Zhang Li, this is Miss Shen Yun. She's the one who's looking to sell the mm -hmm. collection of valuables I mentioned earlier. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Uh huh. And what do you say, Zhang Li, huh? What are you feeling? Uh, you let me say, uh, hey, hey, hey. Tell me about it. Tell me about it. Huh. Hmm. Ah, if it isn't Miss Shenyun. It has been quite some time since our last meeting. What a serendipitous reunion. <clears throat> In indeed, most serendipitous. Uh, have you been faring well as of late, Mr. Zhongli? <laughs> Man. As I, as Quite well, expect. thank you. I was fortunate enough over the past few days to enjoy both a stroll in the mountains and a fresh brew of tea from the most recent harvest. The experiences left me with such insight and peace. Such an old man, man. <laughs> huh. Uh, so you two are already acquainted? Yeah, they, they're acquainted, all right. <laughs> Many years. Indeed. How fortunate we are that fate has brought us together again. If you are otherwise unaware, allow me to inform you that Miss Shenyun is a well-regarded collector and appraiser. She is well-versed in all fields, and oft-celebrated for her impeccable taste. You stand to gain much from this opportunity. Hey, yeah, hey, hey, Yong Li is glazing his girl, man. Oh, shit, huh? <laughs> You are too kind, Mr. Zhang Li. True collectors pride themselves on their wealth of knowledge and eye for detail. I can say without a doubt that you are foremost in that regard. Okay, okay, now they're both glazing each other, okay. Get a room! Get a room! God's sake! Jesus! They're gonna... Why, you flatter me, Miss Shenyun. It would seem that you are as self-effacing as ever. Man, you guys, get a room! God damn it! I can't take this no more. Not at all, Mr. Shangli. Not at all. Um. I swear to God, I, bro, bro, bro. Don't even try me. I told you this once. I told you twice. I told you thrice. I'm telling you a fourth time. Ain't no way my brother did not hit that. While I am loath to butt into this conversation, I must ask. You two already knew each other, and you seem to have quite a cordial relationship. Can I be certain that you're not working together to swindle me? I mean, you never know. <laughs> huh. A preposterous accusation. The heavens themselves would collapse before we would conspire whoa. to do whoa. such a thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come, come, come. Miss Shenyun speaks the truth. Contracts are built on honesty and trust. If that proves to be beyond your capabilities in this instance, this transaction may be taken elsewhere. Say no more. Let us depart. Oh. Uh, 
I jest, I jest. What fool would still harbor doubts after Mr. Zhongli himself has vouched for the goods? Miss Shen Yun, Miss Shen Yun, wait. That's right. My man, my, my man, he says, that she good? You get that. It's good. It's good. Mm. <laughs> <clears throat> I deeply apologize for doubting you. So, um, Mr. Zhongli, could you please give me a final verdict on the value of these items? There is no cause for concern. They are indeed rare and precious valuables. Take this mechanism, for instance. Though one may not immediately perceive its purpose, <clears throat> its structure and appearance are exquisite enough to merit it a place in any fine home. What does it do? Well, it's just like the same fine... can be said for this one here. Few could hope to possess an item that so perfectly blends mechanical wonder with geometric grace. My God, he's blazing her too much. I am sure you have heard from your travels that the study of mechanisms is among the most wondrous arts in this world. With that in mind, I earnestly recommend procuring every last item in this collection. Damn. Damn, huh? All right. Since I hired you as my consultant, Mr. Zhongli, I shall, of course, trust your good opinion. Then, in that case, Miss Shenyun, I'll take the lot. However, since the final sum is quite large, how about we start with an initial deposit through the Northland Bank? The Northland Bank, huh? Hmm. The Northland Bank? Huh. Oh, you refer to the fiduciary house. <sighs> <laughs> I fear people only use the term bank nowadays. In that case, I'll be off. I don't why my thumb. I'll return to collect the goods once anything. you've received the funds. Well, good job, everyone. Good job. We stole it. <sighs> Hello, my friends. Have you been doing well? Yes, we have. We've been kind great! Of, yeah. How about you? Paimon didn't know you were such a busy consultant! He's, he's doing a bunch of side quests now, now, now that he's basically done life. <laughs> My days have been quite pleasant as well. I had been quietly enjoying a cup of tea when Mr. Shaozu requested my services. Uh, it would be nice to... Uh, would that make sense? Could he? Could technically... Could Chong Li technically have children? Why wouldn't he, right? I mean, it seems he couldn't. I mean, hmm. I mean, I would like to see him, like, you know, get the relation, find, like, you know, be in a relationship, maybe. I know why I would, I would want that, but, I don't know, I feel like, you know, become like a, well, he's always, he's always like an old man, but, like, you know, get his family and whatnot. I, that's, that's not something, obviously, he's interested in, but, I don't know, like, have children and, and stuff like that would be kind of cool. Maybe Zhong Li career. <laughs> As for you, Miss Shenyun, I presume you must be looking to settle in the city? I must say, the name Shenyun sounds exceedingly strange coming from you. Perhaps you could dispense of that particular epithet in further conversation. Whatever for, am I not addressing you as a friend should? <laughs> well, that is true, but... <sighs> Alas, refer to me however you will. After all, a name exists such that others may address you with it. One is hardly ignorant of that fact. <laughs> it would seem that you have gained many valuable insights over the years, Cloud Retainer. <laughs> One has indeed. One's previous stays were all brief. Now that one has made up one's mind to move and settle, one has gained a much better appreciation of the hubbub and commotion of the city, as well as the people's hard work and ardor. This city is much changed from how it was more than a thousand years ago. Not unlike the ocean tides, so too shall the movement of people ebb and flow. From turmoil to peace, enlightenment to aspiration. Human society possesses limitless potential. 
In another thousand years, the scene we witness here may change in ways that are impossible for either of us to imagine. That's most likely what's gonna happen. You just... Yeah. All right, that's enough reflection for one day. No need to get all sentimental on us. You make a valid point, Pop I mean, they will be here, but Now he that won't. the sale has concluded, what say one plays the host as we try some specialty dishes together? One must profess great interest in trying bamboo shoot soup. That sounds crazy. Hey, yo, that sounds pretty nice. Actually. Bamboo shoot soup. Mm -hmm. I would like to try it. Perhaps you have forgotten, Cloud Retainer, but I once tried my hand at that dish. And? You were at the table on that occasion, so... Logic dictates that you should have already tried it. Huh? Oh? What occasion was this? It was a reunion between friends several centuries ago. Alas, you must have been too preoccupied to secure yourself a portion. Or perhaps our other companions simply availed themselves of faster reflexes on that occasion. Huh. <laughs> she didn't get to Huh. What? Hardly. T'was most certainly out of consideration for the others in attendance. In but a moment, one will show you what it means to have a true deafness of hand. Mm -hmm. It is settled then. <clears throat> Bamboo shoot soup, mora meat, crab roe tofu, triple layered consomme. We shall enjoy the lot. Damn. One has already passed word to Shen Hun Ganyu to make a reservation. It is prime time for them to meet one's newest disciple. Is that agreeable to everyone? That's so nice. It's like a whole family. It's so wholesome. I love it. I love it. It's like a ah, I freaking love it. A new family <laughs> it member. It should be a most splendid occasion. So we have, uh, you know, uh, Shen He Gan Yu. Now we have the little big one. We have us. We have Mama and Dad. Perfect. We got our whole family. <laughs> Thank you so much, Cloud Retainer. Shu Yu, come now. It is time to dine. Ah. This gentleman over here is Mr. Zhang Li. He is, um... Well, since your disciple and everything, you're gonna... I mean, were you gonna... Sh are you gonna share... I mean, I don't think... In the, just because you're a disciple doesn't mean you have to share that, though. But it can be annoying to keep away from it all the time, but... Would you really want to... Uh, I don't a know. humble employee of Wang Sheng Funeral Parlor. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Yeah, never mind. This is, yeah. Nice to meet you too, Mr. Zhang Li. That should be everyone, right? Let's go! Sounds good. Actually, Master, have you ever tried Adeptus's temptation? I heard it's impossible to stop eating after even just one bite. You know, cause it's super tempting and stuff. Is that true? It's in the name, Adeptus Temptation. Hmm, that sounds rather implausible. Although with the right preparation, so certain funny. dishes can be too delicious to resist. It looks like a family going out to eat. Dad, mom, child, and like bigger sister or something. I, I can't say about the flying baby. I have no idea how to explain that. Huh? Why are you all walking so fast? Hey, wait for Paimon! Why, why are you so slow? Hey, hey, wait up! Come on, hurry up, man. Why are you so slow, bro? And story. You know what? Ten out of ten for being so freaking god dang wholesome, man. I love it. Can I, can I, can I, oh, on a sign letter. Wait, what? Uh, what it seems to um, what it seems like a book of accounts. A letter can be found inside. A little you may be my dear daughter. By the time you read this, mommy and daddy will have already left to go on a long journey. Huh? Your granny may get a little forgetful sometimes, so try to jot down, uh, try to jot down a little for her house whenever you can. Mommy and daddy are counting on you. Take care. You might be wondering why mommy and daddy have to leave. Well. My dear daughter, in this world, everyone got something that they just have to do. Your mommy and daddy are no different. Did you know, daddy was actually awfully sick as a child. How sick, you might ask? Well, even if the doctor could barely feel that uh, daddy's pulse, it was that weak. But daddy still managed to grow up. 
uh, look, uh, looking back, there was many times when uh, Daddy thought he might not make it. In the end, though Daddy pushes through every time, pretty amazing if you think about it. Maybe Daddy is just really lucky, or who knows, maybe he has some super power, a powerful adaptive looking out for him. Either way, uh, Daddy has always felt like he's received a lot of love from this world. You know what, Daddy loves this world right back. He told Daddy that this mission would be super dangerous, but both uh, Mommy and Daddy decided to sign up. You'll have to grow quite a bit taller the next time Mommy and Daddy see you again. They will be uh, so big by then that Mommy and Daddy won't even recognize you. How about this? Let us uh, you let's use a code. Do you still remember that one phrase Daddy taught you when uh, you were alone? That can be a secret. That can be our secret code the next time we see each other again. Uh, that way we'll recognize each other no matter what. You remember it, don't you? While the middle is stands guard, evil shall never prevail. Huh? Hey. What? What are on a special mission? Um, I think I'm. I think I'm missing a bit context. What? What is this special mission? I. I totally forgot. Am I? Am I? I'm dumb. Yeah, I'm dumb. Special mission? Did you talk about that? We thought they both were dead. I have no clue. Um. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um. Like I said again, the story was amazing. I had such a great time about this. And um. I don't know, it was so wholesome, it was not only sad, because sometimes, I feel like, you know, when they end the story, it's like, it's still sad, somehow, somehow a little bit positive, but this one, it felt super wholesome, and I, I, I just, I just liked it a lot. And now, we come to this one, I like how everyone's talking about this hole, and I saw this on Reddit as well, people were trying to speculate what would be here. And some people said, Conria might be here. You guys think Kanye would be here? I don't know. Could be. Honestly, it could be because the entrance didn't they say like there was an entrance uh down here or something? I, I don't remember. Like this was the one way to Kanye. I think they talked about it before. If I don't remember wrong. First, I thought it was such a dumb idea. I was like, why would you guys think Kanye was here? Until I thought about about this place when they mentioned Kanye before, like a way into Kanye. And because uh, I thought for some reason Kanye would be like, I don't know, here somewhere. Don't ask me why either, okay? I, I don't know. I just had a suspicion that Kanye would be like over here or something. I don't know, but it will make quite a lot of sense, right? For Kanye to like somewhat be here since there's supposed to be a way to Kanye there, right? I don't remember, but anyway. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um... Good luck on uh, your wishes if you uh, are trying to go for um, Cloud Retainer or whatnot. Or if you go for Nahida if you uh, didn't get her last time. Uh, good luck on trying to get the weapons if you try to get the weapons and everything. And uh, yeah, hope you guys have an awesome day and I will see you guys in the next video. We finally caught up. That's right, I finally did it. I finally caught up. Mostly because also now that I, I, I have more free time, uh, you know, from school at this moment, that's probably why I have the energy to, use, you know what, let's just push it and do these uh, fast. Or fast, you know. We've been recording for 2 hours and 25 minutes. That should be enough. Alright, peace out.